In 1963, Jazz Athwal was born in the state of Punjab in India before moving to London age seven. He played semi-professional football in his youth. Now he's one of the country's most influential Sikhs and the leader of Redbridge Council. With some help from local club Leighton Orient, he's trying to find the next generation of great footballers. You know, you look behind me, this is our holiday activities and food program. This is going across most of our schools in Redbridge and you just look at the diversity behind me and, and so many of these kids are never going to get the opportunity because of their backgrounds, because of uh, lack of funding and yet there is so much talent behind me all the way across Redbridge and of course across the country. If I was a Leighton Orient or a Tottenham or an Arsenal or a West Ham, I'd be looking at some of these estates, I'd be looking at some of the children who will get overlooked. You do that, you will get the next John Barnes. Life back then wasn't like life is now. And um, we had two teams in the area. We had Caribbean International, uh, mainly uh, black lads. And then we had the uh, Singh Saba, which was mainly the Asian lads, the Muslim and the Sikhs. And, um, and then, of course, we had the top team, where it was a combination of the two. Met recently with um, all my previous teams I'd played for, and Chris Hewton was there. And he looked around the room, and he, he made one statement, which everybody sort of looked at and said, he said, I wasn't the best player in this team by a long shot, but I was lucky to get the opportunity. Everybody looked at him and thought, you're right because he was better than you, he was better than <laughs> like, I mean, don't get me wrong, Chris was good, but some of the other people in the room were absolutely fantastic players who would have made it if they had a fair um, chance at coming going forward.